Hello everyone! Now this is a bit of an update or follow-up to my retro computing setup. Well, there was uh, an issue I had last time. If you'd watched my retro computing setup video, you will know that I was using this freaking thing. And um, I was unable to use more than one computer at once because um, the bleeding between this, you know, it was there not isolated whatsoever, so it was just completely, it was just impossible, it was too much interference between, you know, the um, inputs. Now just to quickly show you, what I have bought is this Bandridge, Bandridge? Bandridge um, skirt switcher and it was from eBay, it was really not that expensive, not as expensive as I thought it was gonna be. Uh, oh, not as expensive as I first saw it, the price just, I don't know, it seemed to just drop. You can see here that it's not just got three inputs, it's got like five. So that's amazing. I needed more inputs actually because some of you know that there's uh, something extra coming. <laughs> so I've actually already set this up. It's over there and sitting there all snuggly, toasty and warm between my retro computers <laughs> while they're all on and uh, heating it up. <laughs> well, I have to say it's working quite good. The uh, screen, the actual picture on this is sharper than it was on this thing. It just, there's less interference and as you can see every one of my systems is on. If I, you know, this is the third one here, if I were to go up the second one, you will see it's the Amiga 500 and the top one here. I make it follow and It does take a bit of time flicking between them, but who cares about that? <laughs> I mean, there was somebody showed me a card switcher that was like really expensive and automatic switching. Now the thing is with the automatic switching, I mean it looks amazing, I have to say. It looks freaking amazing. But the problem is with the automatic switching, I'm not sure if anybody's got any idea, how do you switch between whatever you want? Like for example, I have the Commodore 64 here and um, I can choose that whenever I wish to and I've got the 500 here, I can choose that whenever I wish to. How do you decide exactly what to switch on if you've got more than one system on, on this expen on the other expensive one? You know, it's kind of, it makes you think. Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish off now with showing you the picture quality on, uh, on this. And, you know, I'm just going to do a bit of a capture and show you exactly what each one looks like the Commodore 64 and uh, the two Amigas. And not to forget, I must also mention that the, the Scott Switcher, the Squirt Switcher, <laughs> I must also mention that the Scott Switcher is going into the hate the Scott to the HDMI upscaler. <laughs> and um, this thing I've been recommending to everybody from my videos and everybody on Twitter and Facebook. <laughs> it's just like, you know, hey, get this, it's freaking amazing. And it is. Because, you know, the quality is amazing. I mean, that's pretty freaking sharp. And um, you've seen yourselves that I've been filming nostalgia time with this thing. You know, since the beginning of nostalgia time. So you've been seeing the results all this time. There's no lag, there's no nothing like this, or else it would seriously irritate me if there was some lag or anything like that. So I do highly recommend this, and I also highly recommend this uh, switchbacks. I've also turned it around here, uh, just to show you, this is the output and the rest of them are inputs. And also you got the option of audio out as well, to connect to you know your hi-fi system, so whatever you select will just go into your mixer or hi-fi or whatever you're using. So just to let you know that, you know, I've got one of these, I've tried it, tested it myself, so far so good, I mean this is not even the first day I'm using it, it's like the first hour. <laughs> so instantly I'm just updating you on you know, this. Okay, so that's all for this uh, update video. If you wish to watch the retro computing setup video or the hi vintage hi-fi setup video or the room setup video also, all three of them are linked in the description below or in this letter I here and will be uh, and also of course nostalgia time if you want to see that um, in action the HDMI upscaler <laughs> nostalgia time <laughs> that's also the playlist I've also linked in the description below or this I here too <laughs> so until next time adios